Hi again, guys. Um, I know that you guys had voted for 10 apples up on top, but we have a new baby this week in Early Head Start. Um, so I thought we could read the book, The New Baby, together to help celebrate and to welcome the new baby into, our, into the world. Okay, this is The New Baby by Mercer Mayer. Dad said, we have a new baby. And she's coming home today. I got out my ball and bat and all my favorite games to show the baby. <laughs> Do you see the little baby cuddled with mom? Can that baby play those games? That baby isn't big enough to play with big kid toys yet. She's just little teeny tiny. I found my favorite picture book and read it out loud to the baby. Oh, I bet she liked that. It's always good to read books to babies. They love to hear your voice. Even if you just talk to them or sing to them, they would love that. But the new baby didn't pay any attention to me. Aw. Look at that. She's too focused on having her bottle. He doesn't know this, but I bet the baby was still listening to him. <laughs> she cried a lot, even when I told her my best joke. Look at that. She's upset. We you know, babies just cry sometimes, don't they? I made my funniest face ever, and she cried even louder. Look at that. He tried to make a funny face at her and scared her, I think. And look, now she's crying even harder. <clears throat> what kind of things do babies need when they cry? Sometimes they need their diaper change. Sometimes they are hungry. Sometimes they just want to snuggle. Or they're tired. Do you get cranky sometimes when you're tired? I know I do. I tried to dress her, but she was too wiggly and floppy. <laughs> having trouble getting those arms and legs in there, huh? And sometimes she smelled funny and mom had to change her. <clears throat> Look, I think she's getting her diaper changed, right? Sometimes those are pretty stinky. So what can you do with a new baby? What can you do with your new baby? What do you think? What kind of things do new babies like to do? Mom says we can cuddle her. Aw, new babies love cuddles. And rock her to sleep. Aw. I bet he is a big helper with his new little baby. We can tickle her tummy and make her laugh. <laughs> Or give her a rattle to play with. Look at that. Oh, boink, she got him right in the nose. <laughs> sometimes little babies do things like hitting or scratching or even sometimes pulling long hair. They don't mean to hurt you. They're just curious and they don't understand what they're doing yet. I can give her my finger to grab. Little babies love to hold on to fingers. And let her pull my nose. <laughs> I can take her for a walk and show her to my friends. Put the little babies in the stroller and take them for a walk. Babies love to go for walks. They think I'm so lucky. His friends think he's just the luckiest thing around. He's got a new little baby sister. The end. How did you feel about your new little baby? It's probably pretty cute, huh? Okay, so if you remember, we read a book with this little critter in it before. And we went back through because there's a little animal hiding on every page. This one is a little mouse. 
So let's see if we can find the mouse on every page. Let's go. Okay, where is the mouse hiding on this page? New baby just came home. Can you see the mouse anywhere? Did you find it? <laughs> I hope so. Okay, he's not hiding very well in this picture, but guess what? There's actually two mice in this one. Can you find both of them? One and two. I'll give you a hint. One of them is a real mouse and one of them is a picture. Did you find them? Okay, where's the little mousey in this picture? You can just see his little mousey head. He's peeking at the baby to see what she's doing. Okay, and there's a mouse on each page. So there's two, two mice on this one. Can you find them? One on each page. <laughs> I think that mouse was enjoying the funniest face ever in that picture. Okay, and again on this one, there's two mice. One is not hiding very well, but the other one might be a little tricky. Do you see both of them? I hope you found them. If you're having trouble, maybe you can get a grown-up or maybe an older brother or sister to help you find them. Okay, where's the mouse in this picture? Do you see him? He's not hiding very well in this one, is he? Nope. Did you find him? Okay, here's another one. There's two, one on each page. Can you see the mouse? There's one mouse and two mice. One and two. Do you see them? And two again, one for each page. Okay, oh, I think I might still love that one. All right, <clears throat> where's that mouse? Where is it? Do you see him? Okay, last one. Do you see a mouse hiding in this picture? All right, great job. I hope you found them all. If not, go back and do the video again and maybe see if someone can help you look or you can pause it and make sure you can find it before Miss Amanda moves on. But okay, well, that's all for today. Um, I will talk to you all later and have a great weekend. Bye.